warm welcome. Greetings from C Cube Academy, Chandigarh. Are you struggling to use the correct form when you're speaking or writing in English? In this video session, we'll learn the difference between has, have, and had been, and where and how to use them. So let's get right to it. Now let's start with has and have been first. Has been and have been suggest an action that started in the past but continues in the present, which means they are used when we want to talk about something that started in the past and is still going on right now in the present and is still relevant today. For example, I have been to London. Now in this sentence, sometime in the past I went to London, but the fact is still true today. Another example is, Anastasia has been working in this firm for more than 10 years. Now in this sentence, she started working in this firm sometime in the past, but she still is working in this firm even today, and she may keep working in this firm even in the future. Now in this sentence, this is an example of present perfect continuous or present perfect progressive, an ing verb after been, indicating an ongoing action. When we're talking about the present, if the subject of the sentence is I, you, we, they, or a plural noun, we use have been. For example, they have been married for nearly 50 years, or I have been to Georgia, or I have been an educator for eight years. If the subject of the sentence is he, she, it, or a singular noun, we use has been. For example, it has been raining for hours or Archie has been working in this company for more than 10 years. Now let's talk about had been. When we are talking about past for any subject, I, you, we, they or a plural noun or he, she, it or a singular noun, we use had been. Had been suggests an action that both begin and ended in the past. In other words, we use had been when something began in the past, lasted for some time and then ended. It is entirely in the past. For example, I had been working as a pharmacist for seven years when I quit my job. Now in this sentence, I'm no longer working as a pharmacist since I quit my job. Other examples could be Forsyth Jones had been married to Hermione for 10 years before they got divorced. Now in this sentence, they are no longer married. Other examples could be, people have been expecting a great deal from the new mayor, but he has proved to be a great disappointment. Now in this sentence, people have stopped expecting. Had been is also used when the action happened before another one in the past. For example, I had been living with my parents before I moved here, or I had been working in New York before I got this job. Had been can also convey a wish when the sentences start with if. Now such sentences are only wishful thinking and are neither true in the present moment nor in the past. For example, if I had been there, I would have done things differently. Or if the surgeon had been there, grandpa would not have died. That's about it. Thank you for watching and stay tuned to learn more. Contact C-Cube Academy in order to join our online and offline batches for IELTS, Spoken English and PTE. Thank you and have a nice day and do not forget to like, share and subscribe our channel.